Friday night lights look a little different this time of year. April is here. The weather is getting warmer, so it was time to hit the diamond. The Ace Griffins hosting veterans tonight in Macon, although anyone out there would tell you the weather did not feel warm. After that sun went down, pick it up sixth inning tied up at one. Tied no more. Joshua Chavis screws this ball into right field, and that's trouble for Ace because that's going to score a veteran's run. Chavis with the RBI. The Warhawks take a 2-1 lead. Next batter, Kaysen Flowers. You're going to have to give Kaysen his flowers with a bunt like this. Executing the job. That's a sacrifice, and that's another run for the red, white, and blue. It's 3-1 Vets, and it don't stop there. Top of the order for Jackson Eaton. That boy's gonna be eating good tonight. Smoked like a Christmas ham right up the middle. Chavis, he's rounding third. He's coming home. That breaks open a 4-1 lead. But hold up now, bottom of the sixth. Here's Ace, this looks routine. And then the ball gets thrown away. James Patterson gonna move up to second. Jake McClendon comes in to score, so the Griffins get a run back. It's 4-2. They'd get another on a bases loaded walk, but Veterans holds on for the big road win 6-4. Handed just their sixth loss all year. More scores on the diamond. Number four, Houston County goes on the road to beat Locust Grove. Jones County beats Bainbridge twice in the doubleheader. Same story for Brentwood with two wins over GMC. The Dublin Irish go on to sweep Jefferson County in the twofer. Peach County and Upson Lee split their double in Thomaston. John Millage putting up 17 in a win over Valwood.